Yeah. All right, Captain Jeff Fiorita, Beaver Creek Police Department, F I O R I T A. And Captain, can you tell us where we are and what's taking place here this afternoon? Right, we're here at the Beaver Creek High School around 1.15 this afternoon. We got called to the high school, reference to a suspicious device uh, that was found uh, inside the building. And as precautionary uh, measures, uh, the school did evacuate all the students uh, safely and calmly out to the uh, the football stadium. Uh, at this time, we are investigating as to determine what the device is. Uh, the Dayton Bomb Squad has been called in, uh, again, for safety measures. We are not sure exactly what it is. Uh, we're just taking all safety precautions at this time. Would this be considered standard protocol in lieu of everything that's been going on across the country? Uh, correct. This would be standard protocol for any type of a suspicious device that would be found here at the school. Uh, we work in harmony with the schools as far as uh, showing up here. Uh, and doing what we need to do as far as our investigation along with the fire department personnel and with uh, the school personnel. Well, Captain, can you talk about how the package was found or if it was reported by a student or uh, at this time, uh, I'm not going to go into great details because it's obviously an ongoing investigation. Uh, it was reported to staff. I do not know exactly at this point uh, how it was reported or exactly what it is. However, it did raise concern enough for them to uh, call in the authorities. For not just the students here at uh, Beaver Creek High, but students across the county, um, not, not try, I'm trying, not trying to allude that a student may have placed this, but can you let them understand that this is a dangerous situation? If somebody did this for a joke, it's not fun. Right. Uh, we take these matters very serious. Uh, this, uh, if this were a joke or as a prank, uh, they're going to be prosecuted to the fullest as if uh, it wasn't. Uh, in this case, uh, it is not something that you uh, want to have fun with or play with because it does create a lot of concern. It creates a lot of havoc. Uh, at this point, though, uh, everything is well under control. All the students are safe and in the stadium. And we're working with the school officials at this time as far as uh, possibly uh, as far as dismissal protocol and so forth here. What do you want the parents to know? Is there a special location where they come and pick up their students? At this time, uh, they can just come right to the school. Uh, they're not going to be allowed onto the property at this point. However, there's adjacent parking lots and so forth. And uh, at this point, we're still uh, quickly estimating to see what, how long it's going to be and so forth. Any idea on how long? Again, I know Dayton Bob's not going to have as much right. time as they need, but right. how, how long do you anticipate the school being on, I guess, basically locked down right now? Well, at this point, I have no idea. I'd be only guessing and speculating, and I don't want to do that. Uh, we're working as quickly and safely as we can to uh, get everything taken care of. Anything else you'd like to ask? No, not at this time. Captain, I'm sorry. It's all right. Put it on. Thank you, understand. sir. You're welcome.